This video will show how to delete the bootcamp partition in case you have a dual boot system with Mac OS 11 and Windows 10. As you can see, there is not much space available on the Macintosh drive, so to increase the space, I'll just get rid of the bootcamp partition because I don't use the Windows operating system that much. So to do that, you can go to the bootcamp app. But first, before you do anything, make sure that you make a full backup of your hard drive in case anything goes wrong. The easiest way to do that is to use the time machine and make sure you have a external USB drive which is larger than your MacBook computer. Once you did a backup with your important files or a time machine backup, you can go to the launch pad and tap on other and then click on bootcamp assistant. Then click on continue and then there will be the option to restore the disk to a single volume. In this process, the Windows partition will be completely deleted. So anything you saved on that drive will need to be backed up in case you have anything that you want to keep. So once you already have a backup of your files, you just click on restore, enter your password, and then your main drive should have the original size of the disk. Now the Windows partition has been removed and the disk is restored to a single volume. So after pressing quit, you can see that now there is more space available. So the 128 GB from the Windows partition has been merged into the original Macintosh hard drive volume.